On the first day of the solar term, winter solstice, the daytime is the shortest, and night is the longest in a year in the northern hemisphere. That is why this day has been known as the shortest day since ancient China. Winter solstice marks the advent of the coldest season in a year. Winter solstice was one of the most important festivals in the old times, according to a book written about 200 years ago. Winter solstice is as important as the New Year Day. To the common folks, this was an auspicious day, meaning that the old had gone and the new would arrive. Celebrating winter solstice also means having good food. People in North China like to eat dumplings, particularly during winter solstice. As the saying goes, if you forget eating dumplings during winter solstice, your years will be frozen, and no one will care. While in the south, people often eat blue puddings and rice cakes. In some places, people eat winter solstice ball. Made with glutinous rice flour, wrapped with sugar, meat, vegetables, fruits, shredded radish, it symbolizes happiness and unity. As Dai Shihe depicts in his oil painting "Winter Solstice in Taiping," a place in South China, fresh fish, eggs, bacon, dumplings, and other delicacies. Are all prepared for winter solstice. Painted with bold brush strokes and rich colors, the food ingredients are vivid and true to life. Another important custom in winter solstice in the old times was ancestor worship. In a Chinese painting entitled "Winter Solstice," painter Dai Shuliang. Presents a scene of students paying respect to the teacher, with litter and other gifts in his house. The teacher's wife has prepared a good meal for them. There is also a well-painted portrait of Confucius on the wall. With fine and delicate details, the painting fully conveys the cultural appeal of winter solstice. As the year draws to an end. People have a lot of work to complete. Chen Shuzhong's painting, "Winter Solstice on the Meadow," shows a busy scene of farmers during winter solstice. The small village is covered with heavy snow. A farmer and his family members are busily shoveling snow, sweeping the roof, and keeping the haystack in good order. When winter solstice comes. We know that a year will soon be over. It is time to have a good meal. Send best wishes to parents and teachers, and look back on what we have achieved in the year. And more importantly, we should get ready for the advent of the new year. <laughs>